Welcome! Today we're going to look at fixing scan issues with Brother I Print and Scan. This video will cover multiple models. Even though your machine may not match the model referred to on the screen, the overall process will be the same. Max scan problems may occur for various reasons when using Brother I Print and Scan. Some of the more common reasons are replacing your router or network equipment, scanner network problems, application issues, and driver issues. If you have recently replaced your wireless router and have not reconnected your machine wirelessly, you'll need to reconnect it to the new router. Click the link on the screen to search our database for model-specific instructions on how to connect your machine to a wireless network. Not all devices are compatible with Brother Eye Print and Scan Desktop. Follow the link on the screen to find compatibility information for your model. To activate scanning from the front panel of the Brother device, you'll need to configure both Eye Print and Scan and the scanner driver. This will require the full driver package software to be installed. If you have not yet installed the full driver package, download it from brother-usa.com and install it now. You'll also need to install the push scan tool from our support site. Follow the link on the screen to download it. Once installed, you'll need to restart your computer. First, you'll need to check the scanner driver to ensure that your machine's network properties are correctly set. Click the Apple icon, then click System Preferences. Next, choose Printers and Scanners. If your brother machine is correctly configured, the status should show as idle. If the status is offline, you'll need to delete and re-add your brother device. First, select your brother device. Now click the minus button to delete it. Then click Delete Printer. If your model wasn't listed at all, simply follow along with the following installation instructions. To add the device, click the plus button. If your device is found on the network, it will appear in the list. If your device is not found, you'll need to reboot the power to your router, brother device, and computer. Once completed, try adding the device again. If the problem continues, you may need to reinstall your device on the wireless network. Once the device is found, select your machine. If your device is AirPrint compatible, the operating system will automatically select AirPrint as the default print service. But you can also select the machine by using the CUPS driver by clicking the Use pull-down. Once the service is selected, click Add. From the Finder, navigate to Applications, and then Brother Eye Print and Scan. Even though your brother device may already be selected, click Select Your Machine. iPrint and Scan will now search for your device. Select your device and click OK. Once your device is selected, iPrint and Scan will display all the functions that your machine supports. Click OK. Next, click Machine Scan Settings. Pick the front panel button you wish to assign. In this example, we are selecting File. Confirm all desired settings are chosen, including the file destination and file type. Click OK. Check Change Computer Name Displayed on Your Machine. This will be the computer name that will be displayed on the panel of the Brother Machine. Now click OK and try scanning again. The machine should now scan. If the problem continues, verify that your device is compatible with push-button scanning. Follow the link on the screen to find compatibility information for your model. If your device is compatible, but still won't scan, there may be a program or internal setting on your computer that is blocking the incoming network connection. Unfortunately, such conditions are beyond our support capabilities. At this point, we recommend scanning from the iPrint and Scan desktop application. For more tutorials, FAQs, and videos, visit us at brother-usa.com support. 
If you found this video helpful, be sure to subscribe. Thank you for choosing Brother.